Hi, I'm Avery Lieske, and I'm a third grade teacher in Hoover, Alabama at Bluff Park Elementary. I can't wait to share tips about the book, Who Would Win? Ultimate Shark Rumble. This nonfiction book explores 16 different kinds of sharks. The students get to learn about different shark behaviors, the anatomy of each shark, and at the end, the sharks are battled out and the students discover who the ultimate shark winner is. Comparing and contrasting is a huge standard in third grade. This book is the perfect nonfiction comparing and contrasting book. The students can pick two of their favorite sharks and compare and contrast their behaviors, their anatomy, and different features that they learn about. This book hypes students up about reading because of the vibrant pictures and the ferocious facts about these dangerous sharks. Oftentimes, our students are exposed to a lot of fiction texts. I hope that this nonfiction book will get them excited about science. This book is also fabulous because it exposes our children to nonfiction text features. Our students will understand the importance of bold words and a table of contents and captions. This book would also be fabulous for opinion writing. You could stop the story before the end and have the students use their text evidence that they have gathered and have them determine who they think is the ultimate shark winner. One activity the students could do is create an ad for their favorite shark. They could pick a shark from the book and use text evidence and try to convince other people that their shark is the ultimate shark winner. Art and fusion is so important in the classroom. So one activity the students can do is they could watercolor their favorite shark and then write facts about their favorite shark. And then you can display them as a gallery wall outside of your room. One way you can use this book virtually is by having your students pick their favorite shark that they learned about and then having them create a video, maybe using Adobe Spark or Zoom. This would be fabulous to help your students practice their communication skills and their research skills. This series flies off our library shelves. Trust me, you're going to want to get this book and maybe even the whole series for your classroom library to get your kids excited about nonfiction reading.